Welcome to Penobscot Bay and the vibrant coastal community of Lincolnville, Maine. Home to some very famous people, the seaside port is a great place to take a break, have some fresh seafood, and enjoy the beautiful sandy beach. It would also be a great place to call home. Lincolnville is just shy of two hours from Portland, an hour from Augusta, just over an hour from Bangor, and a quick 20-minute ride to Islesboro on the ferry. Did you know that Lincolnville has just over 3% unemployment rate? Now you know. For local medical facilities, Lincolnville relies on Waldo County General Hospital in Belfast or Penn Bay Medical Center in Rockport, both of which have been serving the Midcoast region professionally, compassionately, and efficaciously. Efficacious. Isn't that a smooth-sounding word? It means wicked efficient. Need a bite to eat? On the waterfront, Whale's Tooth Pub is serving if you are up for some lobster. Or perhaps McLaughlin's Lobster Shack on the right side of the beach. Or on the other side of the beach is the Lobster Pound. Lincolnville has you covered. Or you may consider taking a spin over to Lincolnville Center for the Lincolnville Center store. John Fishman... The drummer for the rock band Fish owns the store and restaurant and works well with local suppliers. Stop in for a moxie and some lunch. A little further south from the Lincolnville General Store is Astor and Rose at Youngtown Inn, which is a classic 1810 farmhouse that has been fully gussied up. The fire department of Lincolnville is an on-call service, which means there is not a firehouse full of firefighters waiting for the horn to blow. Instead, they are working or sleeping in the community, and when a call comes in, those on call respond as quickly as possible. Fortunately, Lincolnville has a great facility with quality equipment and well-trained firefighters. Lincolnville does not have a police department. Like many small towns, it relies on the Waldo County Sheriff's Department. The county sheriff's deputies are well-trained, thorough, and quick to respond to local issues. However, in the case of something gravely sinister, such as the recent Kelvin Kuritz murder, they work with the state police who handle the investigation and subsequent rest of Matt Pendleton. There is a great communication and cooperation between town, county, state, and even national police agencies. Care for a swim? The town has beaches. Breezemere Park is a small freshwater beach on Norton Pond. It has a deep water swim float, no lifeguard. The town bandstand is nearby with picnic tables and a grill. Duck Trap Beach is a small sand beach that is a bit pebbly there on Penobscot Bay located at the mouth of Duck Trap River, Hal Point Road off just off Route 1. And then there is Lincolnville Beach, White Sand Beach on the bay, surrounded by restaurants, shops, and the Isleboro Ferry Terminal. Life couldn't get any better. Are you into fishing and canoeing? There's McGuntacook Lake, Norton Pond, Coleman Pond, Moody Pond, and Levenseller Pond. Are you interested in artists and artisans? Lincolnville Beach is home to Duck Trap Decoys, where you can view the finest and most extensive gathering of wildlife carvings in Maine. You can find them at 10 Simmons Court. How about some hiking? Tanglewood is a University of Maine 4-H camp within Camden Hills State Park. Trailhead is on Tanglewood Road. It has a parking area, a 4.5-mile loop, and there is a 2-mile jaunt beside Duck Trap River and Black Brook. Are you a history buff? Well, if you take Route 173 right there in the center of town, that's the road to Lincolnville Center, a.k.a. Beach Road, there at 33 Beach Road you will find the Lincolnville Historical Society inside the old beach schoolhouse. Much history, both nautical and agricultural, will capture your imagination and attention. This is Lincolnville, this is Lincolnville, Maine. Now I have a question for you. Do you want to see more? More videos like this? Well then, please hit the subscribe and the like buttons and we'll see you on the next video. Yeah, thank you for watching.